afternoon and welcome back. Thank you for joining me. All right, we're just going to jump right on in and I'm going to try and get a message for us. Okay, okay. Here, what virtues are at work here for the message that you have right now? What virtues are at work in this message? I feel like this is going to be a real um, risque message. <laughs> it's going to be a lot going on. Spirit's patience keeps coming up, y'all. Patience, love, and contentment. Patience, love, and contentment. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. All right, Spirit, talk to me about this situation here. Can you tell me about this situation here? How did this happen to the collective? Let's find out the tea. Uh-oh, somebody was a psycho. That's how this happened. It was a lunatic who was crazy. That's a big knife that that person has, y'all. Look at that person. Wow, somebody, they look so innocent and sweet, but Spirit says that this happened because they were so like psycho. All right, what's being hidden by this psycho? Spirit says, what's being hidden is that there's a divine star-crossed destiny. This person doesn't know that there's a divine star-crossed destiny, or maybe somebody else doesn't know about this just <laughs> destiny. Somebody has a destiny here. All right, what's being shown, Spirit? Uh-oh, there's a card in the wrong deck. The fresh start. How in the world did that get there? I'm sure that was no accident. All right, what's being shown, Spirit? Oh, somebody's alone. Somebody's ending in finality. Somebody's having an ending. You may have found um, a pin, like one of these, a safety pin recently, or maybe you have safety pins that you have put together that way. <coughs> this, There's a psycho. This, this happened because of somebody being psycho. What's being hidden is that there's a destiny, and what's being shown is that somebody's alone. And what is our role here, Spirit? What should the... Look, another one, y'all. How does this keep happening? Uh-oh. Not a tower. Not a tower. So, I have a tower and a fresh start that came out of here when they were in the wrong deck. What should the collective do, Spirit? Spirit says, get rich and be cold-hearted, frozen. Spirit says, oh, wait a minute. Maybe somebody's money is frozen. I don't even know. And then unrequited, unmatched love on the bottom of the deck. Wow. All right, I need to get some details about Psycho here. Spirit, talk to me about how this happened with this Psycho. Can you tell me how this happened with this Psycho? What happened with the psycho? How did this happen, spirit? Alright, somebody got scorned. Disconnected and were being childish. Somebody got scorned. And they were disconnected. Because somebody left them, they got scorned and acted childish. Somebody didn't want to be with this psycho anymore. So they got scorned like scorned is when somebody's uh, beyond angry like that's a psycho level of angry like when you want to burn the whole city down just because somebody won't talk to you anymore and they're being very childish because somebody didn't want to talk to them anymore they got ghosted and they became very upset and childish all right talk to me about this destiny spirit how how come destiny's here? Can I can I use these? Why is destiny here? Divine star crossed lover. Show me the energy of this. Can you show me the energy of the psycho? The three of wands came out for the psycho. So this person is on the move somewhere. They're moving. They're they could be traveling. Clarify the three of psycho. I mean. <laughs> Clarify the three of psycho. Look what's on the bottom of the deck turned over. The call. This person's got a destiny. Talk to me about destiny here. Talk to me about this psycho's destiny. 
the four of wands came out now wait a minute they might be heading somewhere for a vacation they might be going to a celebration because that's like a wedding they might be on their way to a wedding why are they on their way to this wedding because of the six of pentacles which is about being generous what are they going to this wedding to do, Spirit? <laughs> Damn. The Empress and the Messenger of Fire came out. Are they going to talk to this Empress at this wedding? What do they want to say to this Empress, Spirit? Spirit says they are very emotional right now. This psycho is very emotional, and they're not telling anybody what they're doing. I think they're keeping this a secret, but they're planning on going to give a message, a very passionate one. Like, this could be a pissed off, like, look how she looks pissed off, and this is her pretending like she's okay, and she's on her way to somebody's wedding or to somebody's celebration. It could be a birthday party. This psycho is on her way to this woman right here to celebration. And she's keeping it a secret. Oh my goodness. That's what this destiny is about. This destiny is about this woman is going to this person's, this empress's birthday party or something. She's going to this party where this empress is at. Wherever this party is, what's she going to say when she gets there? Spirit said get the other day. What's she going to do when she gets there, Spirit? Spirit said get the other day. What is she going to do when she gets to this party? Spirit says that she's a mystery guest and she's a victim. And the answer is no to this travel and a pinky promise. So she's promised somebody she's not going to do this, but she's doing it anyway. But what's she going to do when she gets there, Spirit? Spirit said, get the other deck. Look, there's an invitation in reverse. So she didn't get invited to this party, and she's pissed off, and she's going anyway. And somebody told her not to go. What is she going to do when she gets there? Spirit says, there's, this is a warning. Warning? What about this warning? She wants to cause pain because of her emptiness and because they won't talk to her and they left her. What is she going to do to cause this pain, Spirit? What is this psycho going to do to cause pain? She's fixated, dependent, power hungry, unstable, and she's going to embarrass somebody because they doubted her and they repelled her. Wow, this chick is out of control. She's projecting her feelings onto others. Why is alone here, Spirit? Why is alone here for what's being shown? Justice in the Seven of Wands. Justice in the Seven of Wands. This has to do with the police. Why are the police involved with her being alone? Oh, there's a restraining order. She has a restraining order against her, but she's not going to uh, abide by this restraining order. This person is not supposed to be around. This person is supposed to leave this person alone, and she's going there to make a very big scene. What's going to happen, Spirit? Oh, y'all, I cannot make this up. The Five of Swords came out with the Emperor. This man at this party is going to fight with this woman. What's going to happen when they fight, Spirit? Spirit said, he's going to be pissed off. Pissed off, y'all. He is pissed off. And he's going to make a decision. What is this decision going to be, Spirit? What will the decision be? Huh. 
Damn, the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. He's going to give her this money. That's why materialistic and frozen is here. He's going to give her money to shut her up. Why is she trying to be silenced? What happened between him and this woman? This psycho? The Ten of, ten of Cups. What about the Ten of Cups? Why is the Ten of Cups here? Because of this page of fire. This message. Why is this message about this going to make somebody real happy? Oh, it's going to make her happy when she finds out she can have this money. Will she go away? Uh-uh, y'all. The two of cups came out. It's a partnership. She is this person's partner. I think she might be this empress. Alright. Show me who the person is that's going to be in this relationship spirit. There's a temptation, love, and somebody wanting to take their love. This is about somebody not wanting to take their love. This is Empress is the psycho, and she's going to this party. Will they have a commitment spirit? Will they have a commitment spirit? The Ace of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles, y'all. <laughs> Somebody's going to have a new beginning by themselves. <laughs> Who's it going to be, Spirit? There's going to be some deception about what? Clarify this deception. No, I don't think she is this empress. I think she's another, for a third party. Talk about this deception. Clarify this deception. Self-indulgent, envious, and foolish. This psycho is envious of this empress and she's going to this party or this celebration uninvited to cause a scene and something happened that they're going to pay her off to shut her up or she's demanding that they pay her to, to, to keep quiet about something what are they trying to keep her quiet about spirit They're trying to keep her quiet because she's elusive, misguided, and vengeful. I want to know what she's so elusive about. Talk to me about what this woman is so upset about, Spirit. Why is she so upset? What happened? Settling, comfort, and destiny. Destiny's here twice. She feels like somebody should be with her. Like, this woman is determined to be with this emperor. Or if it's reverse the roles if you need to. But this person is determined to be with this man. And Spirit says that's not going to change. Um, Spirit, what else do we need to do here? Because this woman is off the chain. Talk to me about how the angels have their um, empresses back here. How do the angels have the empresses back here? Here it says they're going to resurrect it. All right, what about the emperor? Here it says partnership. And what about this psycho? Here it says protection from the psycho, music, and joy. <laughs> wow. So protection from the psycho at his party. 
Y'all are going to be having music and having fun. You need protection from this psycho at the party. I'm telling you, if you're having a party tonight, this psycho might show up uninvited. And you need to be prepared for that because it's showing up on my table. All right, Spirit, what needs to be surrendered by the Empress? Surrender to trust. Surrender to the magic of who you are. Surrender to setting limits and surrender to prayer. How about the Emperor Spirit? Surrender to receiving support and love and surrender to resentment. How about this Psycho Spirit? <laughs> surrender to non-action. Like, just be still, Psycho, and stop this nonsense. And your addictions. So, this person's trying to get high and they want money to get high. And they're going to try and do some stupid stuff. To get money out of this couple who's having this party. All right, Spirit, what message do you have for the Emperor and Empress out of this deck? Spirit says, a fiery climax approaches and a new romantic cycle begins. What else, Spirit? That's justice. Oh, Spirit says, believe in the impossible. Nothing is yet set in stone and surrender to the divine. It's time to take action. What do you mean it's time to take action, Spirit? Talk to the Emperor and Empress here. What do you mean it's time to take action? You need to start manifesting. Clarify this magician. Clarify the magician, please. This is the Four of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. <coughs> All right, so there's some confusion. The Spirit is saying, don't be confused about this woman's stability because this woman is unstable or this man, whoever this psycho is. Spirit is saying, do not be confused about this. And then I have the Empress in reverse on the bottom of the deck. Spirit, talk to me about this Empress out of this deck. What about this Empress out of here? Can I get... Spirit says this person has fertility. You need to trust about your fertility. So there's something about a baby and you need to trust. All right, what about the Emperor? What about the Emperor in this situation, Spirit? What would you say to the emperor in this situation? Spirit says you need to tell the truth. You need to travel, tell the truth, and know that you have empowerment. So something happened where you need to tell the truth about this and be empowered. And how about the psycho? Spirit says this person is just pissed off. That's all that's up with them. They are pissed, y'all. And they are confident in what they're fixing to do. They're fixing to try and screw somebody's day up. All right, Spirit. Talk to me about the Empress out of this deck. Talk to me about the Empress out of this deck. Divine Feminine was trying to come out. Talk to me about the Empress, Spirit. Spirit says this person is admired and justice. You're going to have justice. All right. Why, what about the psycho? Spirit says this is a third party and you need to recognize that you had an affair with this person. I have third party recognition and union. This person had an affair with one of y'all. Talk to me about divine masculine spirit. Talk to me about divine masculine. I got to hurry and post this. Alright, Spirit said, remember how you were bound, and this is a lesson about you returning. This is a lesson about you coming back. Something you did in the past, this person you had sex with in the past is a lesson, and they want you to come back. Advice for Divine Masculine. Spirit said, the answer is yes. What else, Spirit? answer is yes to what spirit to being received what about being received the answer is yes to receiving something in a victim the answer is yes to receiving something in a victim
Something happened, and this person is a victim. Or you're going to be a victim. Advice for Divine Masculine Spirit. More advice for Divine Masculine. More advice for Divine Masculine. Here it says you need to protect your family, Divine Masculine. It has something to do with your family. There's something going on with your family here, baby. Holy cow, this is crazy. All right, Spirit, talk to me out of this deck about this situation. Whoa, a lot of cards came out. Talk to me about this. Spirit says to go slow. Don't be in denial about this marriage and these obstacles. Slow down and don't be in denial about the obstacles in this marriage. Anything else, Spirit? Somebody's going to understand this message. And if you're having a party, you know you need to know that you might have an uninvited guest coming. And they a psycho. And they're trying. Spirit says this rejection and the chemistry. Spirit says I want to warn you about this being on different pages. There's somebody that you have rejected that felt a lot of chemistry for you. Spirit says warning. This person is not on the same page as you. Anything else, Spirit? Anything at all? Somebody's having trust. Somebody needs to trust that this is true love. Trust and true love came out again. And I saw that for somebody else. And then on the bottom of the deck is integrity. Something's going on here, y'all, for real, for real. What would I get out of this deck? Like, I'm just trying to get everything I can for this situation so you'll know who you are. I have a feeling you already do. Somebody had sex and their boundaries were trash. What else, Spirit? Somebody had sex with this person. And now they're mad because you ghosted them. Spirit says, we can't be all things. Spend time with your baby. You think you have them all figured out. Keep that shit to yourself. And irritated. If you need help, get help. Okay, Spirit's saying we can't be all things. If you need help, hire it. Make it happen. You might need to hire somebody to protect you at this party. While you're spending time with your with your baby. And you think you got them all figured out, but you don't. I'm telling you, you don't understand how dangerous this person is. They don't like being criticized. You criticized them and you pissed them off. Somebody hurt this person's feelings bad. And somebody needs to do the damn dishes. You don't like it? Change yourself. You want shit to be different? Change yourself first. Golly, spirit. Somebody's going to understand this message, though. I promise you. And I'm so sorry because this person is dangerous. All right, you want to ask some questions? If you're new here, you ask a question, and I'll try to get you an answer out of this deck of cards. All right, Spirit. You got your first question? All right, you ready? Spirit says you need to reconsider and wait. So maybe I'm talking to this psycho. You got your next question? You ready? There it says you need to ask for help from others. And you're ready. All right, one more question. You ready? It's up to you in the near future. Wow. Alright, Spirit. Can I get advice for this person who's acting so crazy right now? How can I get advice for them? Advice for this psycho who's acting so crazy. Dang. Alright, I got the page one. 
and the Ten of Wands. Spirit's saying, I know you're pissed off, but you need to stop this. What else, Spirit? Spirit says you've got this obsession about having this commitment, this marriage, and that this romantic gesture led to you having some competition and that's what's supposed to be transforming your life but you're not letting it you're acting out in in insane ways what would you like to see happen spirit since spirit said this is a tribulation and a trial you're going through this is a trial and i want you to temper yourself control yourself calm yourself down Anything else, Spirit? Uh, you're going to end up in jail if you don't. Uh, Spirit says, this celebration that you're going to secretly, use your hidden knowledge. Use your intuition about this four of wands that you're secretly planning on going to <coughs> before you end up in prison. Period. Trinkets, please, Spirit, for this person and whoever resonates with this man. I have a piece of quartz crystal. I have a bird. I have a little canary or something. I have a tree of life. I have the love between a mother and daughter is forever. I have a skeleton. I have live in the moment. I have a flamingo. I have that angel with those children protecting them on the bridge. I have a hand for intuition. I have Jesus. Maybe your name is Jesus. I have an arrow that says love. I have a, a tree of life. I have a horse. I have an infinity sign. I have two hearts connected. I have an elephant. I have a tower. You're going to end up in a tower. A family's love is forever. I have a snowflake. I have a razor blade. I'm telling you, this person is psycho. Protect yourselves. I have a turtle, an owl, a bee, which represents the police. I have a skeleton key, a pegasus, another fish. You might be having a fish fry or something. I have a heart. I have a butterfly. And I have a little kid. Somebody's having a celebration of some sort. It could be a wedding or a birthday or some kind of party. You probably have balloons and everything like you're probably got it all decked out and you're gonna have a really nice party this person is coming uninvited and secretly to hurt somebody and they're expecting money to silence them and somebody needs to do something before they have a disaster today trinkets from the other ball spirit i have no matter where a piece of crystal the world you are my sunshine i'm a rocking horse for a baby i have some cherries i have a horse i have a cat desk. i have william shakespeare and every fair from fair sometimes declines i have an infinity sign and i have my pirate the cool ass spirit wearing the bandana Please, please, please protect yourself. If you know that this sounds like your situation, take precautions to protect yourself from this individual. I love you guys, and I'll be back shortly with another message. Bye-bye.